influence. Wow, well, a puppy is racking up some frequent flyer miles, all thanks to a major mix-up with American Airlines. A Texas woman claims the airliner lost the puppy she had just bought for her eight-year-old son. She says when she went to pick up the puppy flown in from Kansas City, she realized the dog that arrived was not the dog that she bought. That dog was actually supposed to be delivered to a different family in Portland, Oregon. So as you can imagine, she was not at all happy about this confusion. You should know where the dog is. It's like a baby, it can't talk. You need to do extra stuff to make sure that pets don't get lost. Well, it turns out her dog, Atlantic Ocean, was flown from Kansas City to Dallas, then to Portland, then to LA, where she spent the night. She's expected to arrive at the San Antonio airport this afternoon. American Airlines says it's now trying to figure out exactly what went wrong. Her dog's name is Atlantic Ocean? Yeah. <laughs> That's All right. the dog's name. It's a real, <laughs> it's a real uh, That was your takeaway from the story, Steve? I, my takeaway was that <laughs> if I saw that other dog that came, which was super duper cute. You would have kept I it? I would have been like, can I? But that was Maybe somebody was else's fate. dog. It was, well, I know. What was his name? So Pacific? You're a <laughs> it has Pacific Ocean, right? A different oh, breeder. there you go. All right, let's talk uh, weather. And there are lots of great dogs around here. Lost Dog Rescue and the Humane Society mm -hmm. that you can get. So you don't have to worry about their stuff at all. Right. You can just go down to your local Humane Society. How about a dog? A cute one. And they have cool names like Kona, and Bear, Pacific <laughs> not Pacific Ocean or Atlantic Ocean, stuff like that. <laughs> All right, so this is what's going on outside right now. A gorgeous day compared to yesterday when it was cloudy and dreary. Now we are at 50 degrees at Reagan National Airport, 51 at Warrington. It's still chilly along the I-81 corridor, but you know what? At least we have the sunshine out there, and at least we have temperatures that will be in the lower 80s by the end of the week and even more important into the first half of the upcoming weekend. Temperature change compared to yesterday at this time, anywhere between about five to eight, even 10 to 13 degrees warmer. A good indication of what's on the way later on this afternoon. Now that our skies have cleared out, we're looking at plenty of sunshine. Grab the sunglasses because you're gonna need them, not only for today, but even into the day tomorrow as we begin to build our temperatures up, working our way toward the end of the week. A few clouds remain just to the north and east of Baltimore. It will stay dry for the remainder of the afternoon. If you're going out to lunch, take advantage of the sunshine. Bring a light jacket with you and those sunglasses. Temperatures will be in the lower to middle 50s. No problems for the rush hour commute. We're talking temperatures around 55 degrees by 6 p.m. Beautiful sunset this evening at around a quarter to eight. Those daylight hours get longer and longer. And with mainly clear skies tonight, that means a chilly overnight. Temperatures around 30 to 38 degrees with winds out of the north at around five miles per hour. Now waking up tomorrow morning, a chilly start to your Wednesday but I already will be halfway through the work and school week. Then we warm things up tomorrow into the upper 50s to around 60 degrees. Keep in mind our average high for this time of year at 65 degrees, so still a little bit below average. The real warm up arrives once this area of high pressure moves off the coast. We're gonna see a change in wind direction more out of the south and southwest. That's what's going to warm us up on Thursday, even more so on Friday. And by Saturday, we're talking temperatures in the lower 80s. Wish we could continue it for the whole weekend, but we have a cold front off to the north and west of us. That's what's going to cool us down on Sunday. Bring us a few showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder, and then a cooler start as we move into next week. Let's break down the forecast for you. We're going to start off with tomorrow. Temperatures around 60 degrees, near 75 on Thursday. I'll cherry blossom uh, alert for that day because it's going to be so windy and warm. A lot of those petals are going to begin to fly off the trees. Lower 80s on Friday, beautiful for the parade on Saturday. Temperatures start off in the lower 60s with highs around 82 to 84 as we move into the afternoon hours. Now, Sunday, day of transition, we've got a cold front out of the way, showers and a few thunderstorms, and then a cool start to next week. But at least we're not in the 40s for daytime highs. We'll take temperatures in the 60s, the 70s, and the 80s. Sort of sound like a radio spot there. Best I'll, of. Yeah, I'll even take that 69 degree day next week. I mean, anything over 40, it's good. I'm good. It's perfect. Yeah, all right. Thanks, Steve. Yep. Well, coming up on ABC 7 News at noon, a teacher's note to parents as her frustrations with bad behavior boil over. Why she says it all on them. The ABC 7 News app is brought to you in part by My Eye Doctor, doctors of optometry. How is affordable dentures and implants so much less expensive? It's all they do, so they're amazing. But who has time for all that? Everybody. They made these while we waited. <laughs> Took one day. They'll treat me okay? Like family. I can't believe I'm doing this. 
we should have done it years ago. For affordable dentures, implants, and extractions, call 1-800-DENTURE today. One call and one day can change your tomorrow. You get more for your money at Thompson Creek. Because we do it all, design, build, and install, you won't pay middleman markup. We make your windows right here in our local factory. So you get high quality windows at an affordable price. We're celebrating 38 years in business and you save 38%. Buy one window and get one 38% off, plus zero interest until 2019. That's more than a window. And more for your money. Sweet home, sweet home, Call 855-57-CREEK. Lee Cut attaches our gutter system to your home with our patented bracket every 24 inches with screws, not nails. So your LeafGuard gutter system will support up to 200.